Back to Tampa, our Museum of Science and Industry is about to get an out of this world upgrade. Mosey's announcing plans to open the second largest planetarium in the country. Fox 13's Aaron Mesmer shows us what's in the works. One, go. <laughs> Learning comes easy at the Museum of Science and Industry in Tampa. When they get a chance to kind of explore freely, it's a little less structured than being in a classroom. Mosey is almost all hands-on and all fun. That's what keeps Ashley Steiger, a teacher at Learning Lodge Academy, coming back with her students. Problem-based learning is kind of the way kids figure things out on their own, and obviously our goal today is to have them be problem solvers. The experience should continue into Mosey's planetarium, but this room only fits 46 people, so a lot of families just can't find a seat. That's about to change. You're going to come in and forget that you're on Earth. CEO John Graydon Smith announced Mosey is transforming its old IMAX theater into the second largest planetarium in the country. It'll seat more than 300 people and feature this type of 360 degree movie with 10 digital projectors and new 8K film technology. This allows science to surround you and engulf you and you're immersed in it. And it's not just outer space, it's also underseas. It's Mayan, ancient mysteries of the Mayan people. Smith believes the new planetarium will keep kids interested in science and technology as they grow into adults. Tampa Mayor Jane Castor says that's important with so many companies moving to the area. One of the reasons that they do that, besides the fact that we're paradise, is that they have the skilled workforce available. Smith says the multi-million dollar project should have one additional lasting impact. He hopes it puts to rest any speculation that Mosi may move to downtown Tampa. Mosi is an anchor institution here in a revitalized uptown across the street from USF, and this is just the first sort of signal uh, to everybody that, yeah, we're not taking that anywhere with us, so uh, we'll be here to stay. In Tampa, Aaron Mesmer, Fox 13 News. So Mosey has already been installing the new screen. The new planetarium is scheduled to open in the first half of next year.